Cheers from Sweden and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will talk about which web browser, according to me at least, is the best one for your Galaxy tablet. And just to set some form of context. I don't just surf the web on my tablet. I use my phone and Windows computers as well. So being able to sync bookmarks, passwords, etc. across all devices is perhaps the most important thing for me. And that is why I don't have Samsung Internet on this list. You don't have a desktop browser app, even though the mobile app is really, really good. So, my main browser of choice is Edge. Yes, Microsoft Edge. I know, Edge might not be the coolest browser in the world, but I'm old and um, I'm only interested if the app works as intended or not. And Edge works flawlessly on all of my devices and the synchronization is perfect. One neat little feature is that I can on the mobile app send a certain web page to any of my computers with Edge logged on on the same account. And the computer doesn't have to be on or on the same network. A really good feature whenever you'd like to read the interesting article you found when you had some spare time using your phone. And then you have collections, where you can save web pages in a, well, collection. Or as Microsoft says, organize your ideas in collections in Microsoft Edge. I save, for instance, things I'd like to buy or IDs to use for different things, like my outdoor barbecue area. <laughs> as far as I know, extensions doesn't sync between desktop and mobile. It does between desktops. But I only use an ad blocker and this is built in in the mobile app. So I'm happy. In some way, this collection thing is a killer feature for me. That's a huge reason for me to use Edge as my main browser. But there are some things Edge doesn't do well. And this could be, well, one important thing for some people who uses a lot of web apps. Some of these web apps works better if you enable desktop mode in the browser. So if there is a mobile browser where you under settings can set to always use a desktop mode, that's a good thing. You can do this in Samsung Internet, but as I said earlier, you don't have a desktop app for that browser. But you can use Brave browser instead. And Brave is my number two browser that I only use for web apps. I noticed when I had some issues with an app called Soundtrap. I might make a video about that. Just let me know in the comments below if you would like to see that. I could not export a track using the Android app, but I could if I use the web app instead and then using desktop mode. At first I thought I would should use something internet, because as I said before you can set to always use desktop mode. But I like to add the web app to the home screen as well. And that's where the problem occurred when using Samsung Internet. For some reason, when you open that icon 
or shortcuts to the web app. It's open in well m- mobile mode instead of desktop mode. Kind of strange if you ask me. But in Brave it works. Brave uses the desktop mode if that's what you want. Perfect for, well, in my case, Soundtrap, or if you like to use um, the web version of um, Microsoft Office. I know my example is perhaps a little bit narrow and doesn't comply to everyone, but it works for me, so, well, I am happy. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe, and stay safe. Bye.